Hey guys, it's Matthew with Matt's Reef Tank here with a uh, a bit of a personal message. I'm not really happy about it, but I just want to give you a, an idea of what's upcoming. This is not a fishy Friday. This is the first of a end series that I will be doing. The office here with the big tank is uh, closing up. So we are going to have to empty everything out and uh, close up shop. What will be the future of the reef tank? That is still a question that's up in the air. The uh, tank has a chance to survive. There's a few options. First, my friend Leo, who owns Cove, has uh, graciously said that he'll take whatever uh, fish or corals that uh, I want to kind of uh, donate and watch over, and he will take them in his personal tank. A few select fish that I really want to have by myself and, and have with Annie will go to the house tank. I haven't decided who will go there yet. Uh, there's not a lot of room in that tank. Hopefully I can move a couple of pieces over to the house tank. Ideally, what I'd like to do is move this whole tank and everything in it to a school that uh, Annie's niece and nephew go to that would in turn take care of the tank, learn some things about marine biology, and get taken care of by the students. It's a lot of work. Uh, I would have to do some courses with them to teach them how to take care of the tank, move it all the way over there, make sure that it's all set up, and in doing so, I'll have a really cool final video series of Matt's Reef Tank that can show you the transition. We haven't quite figured out which one we're gonna do yet, and I will keep you informed as soon as we know. I'm talking with the school right now, and we're trying to figure out if that's something that they would be interested in. It would be really great to donate the tank into an atmosphere where it can become a teaching tool for learning about how to be responsible uh, for the world that we live in. I'm sad about closing it down, but I'm also excited about the next chapter that will be opening up with me personally. I will take you with me on this final journey. Stay tuned to the final few episodes regarding the big tank. That's about it. I didn't want to do a huge update, but I figured that uh, there were some people wondering what was going on with the big tank, so I thought it might be important to do a, a little bit of an update. Everything otherwise is doing okay in the tank. The corals are doing fine. Everything is actually doing quite well, which I'm very excited about. I wouldn't want to donate a tank with a failing system, but so far things are doing very well. And hopefully we can move everything in such a way that nothing gets hurt, everything thrives and finds a new and exciting home. With that being said, uh, have a good day, enjoy your tanks, because you know, life changes and sometimes you might have to move on and so you have to enjoy every moment that you have with them. May your pH never waver, may your nitrates never rise.